6 November 2017 um, Sir Mirror's Boys Fight House uh, Midnight Up Brief I, I, I call it that but I'm, it's almost midnight but I'm, I'm a little bit peeved so I'm going to ask you guys if you guys can just bear with me um, <clears throat> not too long ago I received uh, a memorandum from corporate uh, corporate offices and this is, this is probably going to tick you off a little bit I just want you guys to bear with um, bring me the memo yeah, no, it's a two-page one. The two-page one is on the other side. All right. All right, thanks. Nice shirt. Um, you know what? No, forget it. I'm, I'm not going to read this. I'm just going to tell you what I think about it. Um, so here goes. It's, uh, it's some BS. The... The corporate offices of the Ramirez Boys Fight House, um, they, by now, they should recognize that we are the highest producing regional office. We, by far, our production is above and beyond everybody else, and we do a lot of outreach. We have outreach that none of the other offices are doing. Um, uh, the Brazil office is doing pretty well, but um, the Cookstown office is by far, far and away, the, the top office. Um, Outreach is probably one of the things that we're leading the most of in the, in the business and the, the company, and um, I'm very proud of that. Um, it, it's one of the one of the things that I wanted to put at the forefront when I first started uh, the organization. Um, for example, right now we have uh, we're doing outside of our local area, outside of regional, uh, we're doing Pacific uh, Pacific area uh, outreach. So we've got Corey of Alaska out there, and he's doing amazing work up there. Um, we're doing a mid-Atlantic regional uh, outreach with uh, Emily, who's out there at Lycoming. Um, we've got several people that go into Pennsylvania on a regular basis. We've got Andy, who's doing a really good job of that. Um, we've got uh, stalwarts that are always, always there. We've got Hugbug, a Scout. Um, we've got a lot of good people. Recently, we branched out with a couple of brothers from the uh, neighboring town area, and those two guys are studs, too. Top, top level, top level people. Um, basically... Our efforts um, are going unnoticed by corporate, and it's something that rubs me a little bit the wrong way. Um, so I just, uh, you know, I'm going to read. I'm going to tell you what we got to do because this, like I said, this came down last minute. Um, our fire pit, which corporate has known about for a long, long time, is about to um, be canceled this weekend. Instead of that, we've been tasked with doing a responsibility fact-finding mission up in Worthington State Forest, uh, supposedly clear creeks and um, a clear lake, uh, camping, and a fire pit late at night up there, s'mores and hot dogs, things like that, um, which I, I, I usually don't mind doing, but when it's getting to me at, oh, dark 30, you know, and then I've got to put it out to you guys in a message in a, in a video like this, it's a little annoying, um, so I, I just, you know, I, there, there's, there's, only, um, there's only so much you can take before you start getting, you know, a little peeved. Um, you forgive me, I got a little bit of tea right here, and uh, you know what, let me take an opportunity to showcase some of our local products right here. Now this here is a world-class local honey. Um, it's actually sourced uh, regionally and uh, uh, brought into the organization by Andy. He does a really, really good job of it. So let me just put that into my, uh, my tea, Earl Grey Hot. And let me just drop some in there. Okay, actually, just a little bit more. Okay, that ought to do it. And look at that. Did you like the way I kept that up? That was real nice. Um, so this is a, kind of a leftover from this weekend's past fire pit. There's a fire pit again, right? Thank you, corporate. Um, and while I am mixing this up with my ninja spoon, I am going to showcase another product that's available here at the fight house. Now, these products are not available for order. You know, we're not USDA certified or anything, so we, we don't have the ability to, um, you know, if you want some of these products, you can get with me offline and probably get you some of the stuff. The good stuff, by the way. Um, and I'll showcase here as well <clears throat> some of Johanna's world famous. Uh, these are Johanna's, well, sorry, boys, excuse me. Uh, Johanna's world famous cookies. And I'm actually going to have one of these guys. It's not supposed to be doing this for the diet. Diet video still coming. Oh, my goodness, diet video still coming, folks. Um, so I'm going to have that cookie and have this tea. All right. See, I'm actually going to do it. This is not TV. This is a real deal. Oh, this is good stuff. I should give some of these to Emily before she went back to Lycoming. Hey, boys. Still got my ninja mug and my ninja spoon. It's also got a little ninja, like, uh, 
carrying case, so I'm going to showcase that real quick. All right. Anyway, this has been a very long video, and if you're still watching, um, I can't believe you're still watching. Uh, the Ramirez Boys Firehouse is very proud to, this weekend, do an expedition. To Worthington State Forest, where we will camp out under the stars. This is not going to be a typical mission brief like the one we had last time. All we're going to do is sleeping bag. Sleeping bag only. No tents. No. No tents. Johanna, no tents. Or anybody else, no tents. Um, under the stars. And first thing in the morning, first thing in the morning, we're going into that clear creek, into that clear lake, and we're polar bearing it. And this is prep for something we might do later on in the season because um, it's going to be very, very cold. Anyway, that's it. It's a nice little long little video. And um, corporate offices sees us, you know, whatever. They let me go. And that's, it is what it is. You know, I um, I think I've done, you know, the best I can for the organization. But if they want to go a different direction, then that's fine. I understand. <laughs> it is a business. Well, actually, it's not a business, right? It's a club. Airborne all the way, every day. Love it, boys. Here's Boys Fire House. Oh, it's Boys Fire House. Thank you, Toronto.